guys, welcome to my second vlog. I'm actually at the airport, I'm heading to Dubai, so this is going to be like my Dubai Diaries uh, travel vlog. So, hope you guys enjoy it! So, we are starving and we are eating at McDonald's right now. <laughs> I'm having chocolate. And my friend is having a veggie burger, I've never tried it. it looks good though. Boarding the plane. I'm with my friend Danielle. <laughs> Got some magazines and some sweets. This is so old school, but I don't know. I have good things. No, no. So I always come prepared. They're so pretty, and the camera doesn't do it justice. So we're on our way to our room. So I'm gonna do a little quick room tour for you guys. So first there is a little kitchen over here. We sure will be cooking <laughs> on this trip. And then there's this little seated area over here. There's the TV. The entertainment is very important. Okay. Here is the closet. Here is the bed. I love hotel beds, so let's hope this one is comfortable. Danny is chilling over there. This is the view. Burj Khalifa is actually on the other side, so you can't see it from here. But you can see Dubai Mall down there. <laughs> Check out Danny's bag, it's so cute. Okay, now we're going to see how many things she can fit in this bag. To be an efficient traveler. Yes. See, I can't walk around in a bag this tiny, but... Moisturizer. Alright. Charger. Makeup bag. Headphones. Nail polish to touch up. Okay. <laughs> Panadol. Hand sanitizer. Gum. Perfume. <laughs> Those are because they're tiny things. Lip of course balm. you can fit all these things. No wait, my my e-ticket, my passport, purse, and sunglasses. Wow. That is pretty good. <laughs> so we're just heading out for dinner and we're just gonna have a casual dinner at Dubai Mall. This one just totally reminds you of Carrie Bacho. Look, I really prefer um, Angelina. Okay. Or um, Joe's. Okay. Joe's or Angelina? I heard Joe's is not as good here as London. It's not fantastic, but I've yeah. had. Um, I prefer Angelina over Joe's, but I've had the uh, seafood. I think you video you. Angela. I'm not gonna use all the footage. I'm just <laughs> filming. Absolute terrible. You think angle. this is a nice angle for me? Okay, how about I hold it? <laughs> I will cut that part out. Okay, so we're um, trying to decide what we're going to eat. What to have for dinner? We're so hungry. Um, You're natural at vlogging. Maybe you should just take over. Look how many people are on the escalator. I don't even know what shows. How do you do this? Oh my god. You, nice you guys. Arms. Level. Alright, so. Very natural. She is, she, is, she is taking over this vlog. Let's just take <laughs> Let's just make this vlog. Huh. Alright, Dennis trip to Dubai. Yes. Take one. Um, so we're trying to decide where to have dinner. Sarah, you want to come back to Dublin another time? Obviously. Is that even a question? So I'm getting you on the vlog. 
weirdo. Who's a weirdo? The guy. It's super crowded, guys. And it's a weekday. But I guess the baby is always like that. It's such a creepy just <laughs> so we're at Victoria's Secret and I'm in the pink section and look at this. This is humongous. It's really cute though it says. Let's not talk about it. But it's so huge, like who, who can drink from this? Imagine like Yeah. It's really cute though. We're pretty feet, so hey! <laughs> Should just take a picture of us. Okay, well, we're pretty tired, so we just got back to the hotel to get some rest because we have a long day ahead of us tomorrow. See you guys in a bit. Hey guys, it's day two, and I'm back in Dubai Mall because I finally wanted to do some shopping. And I think I'm gonna go to Sephora first because why not? <laughs> Sephora, of course. Some crazy swatching going on at Sephora. Sephora was, dare I say, very disappointing. Um, actually, when I was walking in there, I was vlogging and I got stopped by security. <laughs> they told me I'm not allowed to film inside Sephora, so that was a shame. So that was a shame. I wanted to sort of vlog and show you guys like the makeup swatches and yeah, I managed to show a bit of a swatch, but yeah, that was a little naughty. But um, yeah, I'm, I was really surprised because I really wanted to check out the Huda Beauty Mink Lashes and apparently they haven't launched yet. But I mean, they've been promoting it on social media and stuff, so I just assumed that it was available. But it wasn't, so that's a shame. And they only had one of the old lashes, they didn't even have any other, they didn't even have a wide selection. And even the nails, like, only had a few, so that's a shame, but oh well. So I'm gonna check out Bloomingdale's and some other makeup places, and hopefully, I will find some more makeup. Surprisingly, I only picked up a few things. So we'll see how it goes when I head to Bloomingdale's. Another thing that was really disappointing about Sephora is that every single second someone is chasing after you to get you to try on things and it's really annoying because especially in these kind of places I like to browse on my own and then if I need help I ask any one of the salespeople but they are literally chasing up after you and sometimes they don't take no for an answer. I always say oh no thank you I'm just looking and then no they they are saying no try it you have to try it it's great and whatever so yeah. So I just saw someone who was barefoot and sitting on the floor. I mean I understand the Mall can be so tiring. I'm already tired but much barefoot. And there are seated areas, like there are areas where you can just sit down and chill. So I don't know, um, poor woman, but still I don't get why she was The floor is probably nasty. I have to say to bring back in, but it's yeah, one of the like people are just well, looking at me and like, people are just staring at me and wondering what I'm doing. So, yeah, I'm getting embarrassed for her to take you guys. Des yeux qui font baisser les miens, un rire qui se perd sur sa bouche, voilà le portrait sans retour. De l'homme auquel j'appartiens So now I'm having afternoon tea at Fort Nim and Mason and I chose a rose tea. I haven't tried it yet, but it smells really good. For dessert, I'm going to indulge in Victoria's sponge cake. It looks delicious. So I'm taking a look at these Ilamasca eyeshadow palettes and I just swatched the liquid, what is it? Liquid metal palettes. And oh my god, these colors are so creamy. They just, they feel so buttery when you apply them and they they just, they swatch exactly how they look. Can't really tell in this lighting, but the colors are so pretty. gorgeous place yes it's really good for pictures selfies I hope you guys can see I want to show my outfit of the day okay so outfit this is the night. Sarah's outfit wearing a Riva top Forever 21 
vest from 25. Uh, Zara jeans and Prada flats. Cash, but yeah. So we're having dinner at the and it's one of my favorite steak restaurants in Paris, so I'm really excited. And it's actually always full in Paris and London, but it's not really full here. I hope it's just as good. Starters are some bread with butter and salad. Okay, time to have the best steak ever. And this sauce does not look great, but it's so good. It's the best steak sauce I've ever tried, ever. I hope you like it, Dunya! <laughs> you played home a little down now. I like the outfits. <laughs> I'm just being creepy right now. Look, they opened. There's Tea Club in Dubai now. That's pretty cool. It doesn't really show, but that's Tea Club over there. So I'm very proud that a Bahaini restaurant opened here. This might seem like a weird purchase, but I found this beautiful letter organizer at Paper Chase and I basically got it so I can store my eyeshadow palettes. Look how cute this looks. I don't know, I, I'm so excited about this for some reason. And yes, I only traveled with my Lorac Mega Pro palette and my Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. But of course, I also brought some single eyeshadows because I mean, why not? <laughs> We're checking out the vintage Chanel bags and I'm obsessed with vintage Chanel. These pieces are gorgeous. Oh, I have this in black, but um, leather. Let me see the blue one on you. So pretty! Oh my god, I love the color! I love it! It's so pretty. This is so my style. <laughs> so, what was it used? What do you think? Oh my god, I love it. So there is live Monopoly going on down here. Come on, Monopoly man, look at me. He's not looking at me. We're heading to an event at Topshop. It's the Kendall and Kylie collection launch. And uh, we'll check it out. Let's hope it's good. So I'm having green apple juice and this is called the morning after wrap and I heard it's really good so I'm gonna dig it now. Hey guys, so you know that term like a kid in a candy store? I literally am like a kid when I'm at a candy store. Like right now I'm in Candy Delicious and I want to buy some candy. This lollipop? It's enormous. It's bigger than my head. Je 
So I'm with Tala and she's Hi. an old friend. We actually met through Twitter. Yeah, and then we realized that we, we were have, friends of friends. Yeah. And then like we kind of knew each other through. Yeah, we have mutual friends. So yeah. that's really cool. And she lives in Dubai and it's so nice that we got to see her. And she has a lovely sister named Nof, which I hope we get to she see her. Have. Nofi, yeah. She's just that word. Yes, and we're having beautiful hot chocolate. And chocolate. And some, yeah, ba just basically chocolate, chocolate overload. Yes. yes. In this beautiful place at DIFC. And yeah, I'll show you guys how it looks like. It's a beautiful Marie Antoinette themed yeah. place. Yeah. My cheeks look huge right now. Oh, <laughs> I actually did a smoky eye today. I wasn't planning on doing a smoky eye. Tell them about your foundation. Oh, I have Vichy Derma Blend. I can't remember which one it was, but um, I'll, po I'll post like a picture about it or something. I think it's the teen something teen. Yeah, I don't know. Tada! Hi! <laughs> I'm gonna get that foundation because it's cool. Oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> One of my favorite places, I'm at Lush, and I'm stocking up on all my favorite products. I also returned some of their containers, and they're giving me a free mask. So if you do have a lot of Lush products, save five of them, and then take them to your nearest Lush, and they'll give you a free mask. Hey guys, so you made it to the end of my vlog, and I'm sorry that the quality of the videos towards the end were really bad. That's just because I ran out of battery while I was there. So I used my phone. So I'm really sorry about that, guys. I really didn't think my battery would finish. But actually, editing this vlog was pretty hard because I have over an hour of footage. And sometimes it's really difficult to decide what's interesting to keep in the vlog because some things I might find boring, you guys might find interesting. So. Let me know, I mean this is my second vlog so I'm still learning so let me know what part of this interested you, what part of this was boring, what part of this you just didn't care for because that will help me improve with the next vlogs. And it's funny because a lot of funny things would happen but I wouldn't be vlogging and I'd think oh my god I wish I was vlogging, you know that would have been a funny moment to show. But you know this isn't rehearsed so I can't just redo that moment or anything and it was pretty funny vlogging in Dubai because people would just stare at me and they were really curious to know what I was doing and sometimes people would come up to me and say hey do you want me to take your picture because they think I'm taking a selfie <laughs> no I'm not just walking around Dubai mall taking selfies that was pretty funny because people felt bad for me and they thought I wanted someone to take my picture <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this vlog, please give it a thumbs up. And please let me know any comments, any feedback. Did you enjoy my first travel vlog? Should I do more of these? Please, I really value your feedback. So feel free to let me know. Oh, also, Mbarak alaykum shahar, Ramadan kareem. I really hope you guys have a blessed month and make the most out of it. All right, guys, take care. Bye. So we're having dinner at the Age and Antoine Coat. That's okay. <laughs> and so, I'm loving it. Sometimes I'm weird when I laugh, I don't know.